Guys, today I am going to Holland and Barrett in the Bull Ring because they have got a whole new beauty concept area. Um, I think traditionally, like a load of people, including myself, always thought that Holland and Barrett was just like wellness, supplements, that kind of stuff. But actually, their beauty department is now stocked full of some of the most amazing brands, brands I use on the regular. Um, obviously, they're all kind of green beauty brands, but I thought I'd take you guys along to do like a little shop with me so you can see what I'm going to pick up today and just see how many great brands there are. But I thought it'd be cool to take you along so you could see inside the store as well. So here we go. I don't even know what to get in your head. Seeking your attention for someone said. Cause I hope you look my way, but no, no. You didn't even see me in cases today. Feeling every day like I'm going insane. Cause you and I are something I wish for every day. in the bullring and you're wondering whereabouts the store is it is literally right there lower ground floor looks very very snazzy very all new and modern so let's take a peek inside Okay, so we are in the store, which is lovely and light and airy. Look, it's not so massive. I think this is like the biggest Holland and Barra I've ever, ever been in. But I am going to start in premium beauty, which is behind me, and have got some brands which I didn't even know you could get from Holland and Barra. So let's have a look at skincare. Let's start with skincare and then we'll move to makeup pampery treatment stuff like that okay so over here we have got all of the premium beauty brands and i must admit that my first like major notice was ren like i love ren clean skincare they are absolutely amazing now these are two of my absolute hero products anyway this i've actually talked about on my blog it is so so good it's a mineral sunscreen it's got spf 30 and it's so so good and really really gentle on the skin i use that all the time on my honeymoon and this primer oh my goodness guys this primer is so good like if you want to make your makeup last like so much longer through the day it gives you like the perfect complexion base so i already have both of those in fact i have quite a lot from ren because i really really love their products but i couldn't help but notice as well that they have got my absolute favorite over here they've got the daily aha tonic this is gonna have to come with me because i haven't got like the full size of this so i'm gonna stock up on some of this i think so in the basket it goes item number one in my little haul so yeah like there's loads and loads of ren bits as well and i also really like um some of these they've got like cute little gifties type sets this is like one of the sets with the aha tonic in it actually and this is only 25 pounds it's got or 22 pounds and it's got three items in there but i am also looking at some of the other things on here that i've never tried from ren like we've got the um this is the number one purity cleansing balm and i love a good cleansing balm 
um, and it's just really nice to see like the full Wren range here. Like again, not a brand I would always associate with Holland and Barrett and it's so nice that you can kind of shop their stuff in here now. Okay, moving down, we have got some Evolve Beauty. Now, I think I've actually tried some of their stuff before. If I remember rightly, this glow mask here is one I have definitely tried before. Um, I'm gonna open it and have a sniff and see. Okay, so we've got the tester, and this is the Radiant Glow Mask, and it's for all skin types. It looks like that, and it smells like chocolate. Oh my gosh. Oh, that's so, so good. I think I have tried it before, I'm pretty sure that I have actually, um, but not in absolute ages. They've also got this one, the Evolve Organic Beauty Miracle Mask. So let's see. Oh, that one smells like aromatherapy oils. Oh, so relaxing. And both of these are 99% organic, which is really, really great because then you know that there's literally no nasties in your skincare. Um, having a little mooch at what else they've got from Evolve in here. They have got the ooh, Hyaluronic Eye Complex, which sounds quite cool. Is that a rollerball? Yes, oh my gosh, it's a rollerball. I love rollerball skincare. It always feels so nice, especially under the eye. It like plumps the area and then you never have to like worry about rubbing it in, but oh, it smells good too. Okay, and look what brand I have now just found in here. We've got This Works, another amazing brand I did not even know you could get in Holland and Marat. They've got all of the Hero products here, which are like the deep sleep pillow spray. This is the one that I religiously use before I go to bed because it basically helps me relax. Like if you spray it on your pillow before you go to bed, um, it will help to like relax you. So effectively you should then get like a much deeper sleep at night. They also have the Plus pillow spray, um, which sounds quite nice. Now they're out of stock of this one, but I may actually grab one of these instead I think maybe my second little item for my haul because I do really rate this range but it's nice to see some other bits in here actually I've never seen this this looks quite cool okay so this is the deep sleep super blend which sounds really really nice is that like a aromatherapy oil I think it is um, a more concentrated version they've also got the smaller size rollerball I believe which is quite cool um, and then they oh wow okay maybe I actually get this because this says it's a stress check breathe in um, a rollerball to perfume your skin and calm your senses now I am a bit of a stress head as my husband likes to tell me so this I think I may actually get this one because if that helps uh, de-stress I'm pretty sure my whole family would enjoy a, a, a less stressed mama okay so I've just picked up the deep sleep breathe in and the stress check breathe in these are both rollerballs and I thought I'd actually test them both just to see kind of what they smell like and how relaxing they are and which one I think would be better. Oh wow, the stress one smells lovely. Okay, now on to the deep sleep one, which I have this in several forms. Okay, so that one's a lot more relaxing actually, but I think I do prefer the stress one. Yeah, it smells really, really nice. So it says it refreshes and calms your senses um, so you stress less, which uh, I could definitely do with some help with. So I think rather than my top up of the pillow spray, I'll probably go for this one because then I can just keep it in my handbag or my desk when I'm working and stuff like that. So that will be going in the basket. Okay, now we have moved around to, to the makeup. And this is Inika, who I have actually spoken about on my blog before, guys. Um, they are vegan friendly, cruelty free. They're one of those really lovely brands where you don't have to worry about any of the products um, because all of the ingredients are made so, so nicely. And in here, we have pretty much the whole range, which is quite cool. So I'm not really sure where to start. I quite like the sound of this mineral blusher over here, um, which looks quite cute. So we'll have a little look at that. Okay, so it looks like that. And then, ooh, it comes out with a real like shimmery finish. I'm not sure if you guys can see that, but I really like it. It's very, very like gentle on the pink. Okay, then we've got some of the baked mineral blush duo, which is more of like a solid blush, which I think is really pretty. And if you just add some of that on there, again, very, very gentle. I probably need something a little bit darker for me, although that is very subtle for every day. Okay, now we've got some of the loose mineral bronzer. This is in the shade Sunkissed. So this sort of stuff should come out quite nicely. And again, it's a really delicate brand, I think, by the looks of it. All of the shades are very, very gentle. 
just the tiniest bit of colour, so great for every day. I really like that bronzer actually, it's very natural. It's quite warm, I think if you've got cool toned skin maybe it wouldn't suit you, but actually the fact that they've got it and it's loose means you can just blend it up on the skin, which would be great. Okay, I just also saw that they have um, an organic BB cream, they've got organic liquid foundation, um, they've got multiple shades in it, which sounds quite cool. So I've picked up the BB cream, but I think I actually would like to try the nude foundation more. So let's have a look. This is the foundation that we're looking at. This one is in the shade nude. So I thought actually if we pump it out, we can see what kind of coverage it gives. Oh, that's nice. And actually it's quite a good match. That's the shade nude and I'm just blending it in on the skin. And actually it blends really, really nicely. It feels really gentle. Um, it says on here, I'm trying to see what coverage it is. Oh wow, it's got hyaluronic acid in it as well. Okay, so it's a medium coverage foundation. I actually think I picked up the first one and it was nude and that was actually a really, really good match for me. So I think like for 33 pounds, that's quite good for like an all organic, um, foundation and the fact that I've never tried this before there's like mineral foundation there's baked mineral foundation they've got the liquid foundation and the CC cream as well as primer so there's actually a ton of different finishes to try there now I do like it I don't actually need a foundation but you know me guys always on the lookout for good new ones but I may revisit and actually Maybe I'll pick it up. There is another brand just next to us I also want to try, let me show you. So this is Pure Handmade British PHB. Never heard of these guys, but actually I love the packaging. I love the simple ethos of the way that it looks. It's like no frills, but very, very like organic ingredients, like 100% pure. I love that they've got lipsticks, they've got pressed mineral foundation, normal foundation. And I think that is probably what we're gonna check out first and see how we can color match and see what that's like when you kind of test it on the skin. Okay, so we've got tinted moisturiser and bare skin BB cream. Now, the moisturiser's got SPF 25 in it, the BB cream's got SPF 15 in. Now, I think I quite like the sound of the BB cream because those um, are better when you're looking for like a full coverage type thing. So I think I'm going to go in with the light. Okay, so this is what the packaging and the branding looks like. Um, and it says that this is like bare skin but better with sheer buildable coverage. So let's have a little look. Okay, so that's how that one blends. That is like way darker than I thought it was gonna be. Okay, so that is the light shade, which is actually a lot darker than I thought it would be, but it blends really nicely. It feels a little bit like a moisturizer, actually. Um, it's clearly a little bit too dark for me, even as the light, so we may need to go down to like fair or even porcelain and see what that one swatches like. Okay, so this is the shade fair, which I'm hoping is actually gonna come out a little bit lighter because that other one was way too dark for me. Oh yeah, that's looking much better already. So if you see, again, very nice. It blends very much like a moisturizer, I think. I really like that I'm kind of now torn between like this bare skin cream which feels quite nice and I think would be really great for like an everyday like when I'm doing the school run and I don't really want to wear a whole ton of makeup and it is only 20 pounds which is really good I've got tinted moisturizers that cost a ton more than that and it smells quite nice too you can definitely smell like the essential oil element of it so I think I may add that to my basket Okay, so this brand, Lily Lolo, again, another um, original, it says British mineral makeup brand, and they have everything from an eyeshadow range, they've got some lipsticks. I quite like the sound of these lipsticks, but I actually just really wanna try some of these shadows. So this one is Ivory Tower. That looks really nice, actually. Truffle Shuffle, I think I just like the name on that one. So just want to see how they perform on the skin as well. Okay, so that's those two shadows completely swatched. Now I really like how shimmery they are. And they're only eight pounds each, so I think that's an absolute bargain. Yeah. 
Okay, so over on this side we have got some Trilogy products, which sound quite nice. Uh, these are all currently on offer, which is quite cool as well. And then I have actually just spied Antipodes. Oh, I love their honey mask. This one up here on their sign is such a good face mask, guys. I absolutely love it. I have actually also used this day cream because it's kind of the same sort of um, range. I'm trying to see, yes, they've got it. Oh my goodness, they've got it. This mask, oh my gosh, one of my absolute holy grail go-to face masks it's got manuka honey in it it is literally great for hydrating if you have blemish prone skin anything like that guys this mask is a go-to 27.99 i promise it'll be the best face mask you've ever used i love this if i didn't already have a full tube like backed up and ready to go at home i would be picking this up today so i was only actually thinking today that i need a new tan and hence being this pasty and pale i didn't even know that you could get this like a whole range of like green beauty tans but there's like a whole collection of them to check out here i did just notice this brand over here tan organic who i've never heard of but this self tan mousse actually sounds really really lovely guys um it's completely organic which is really nice and obviously what you'd expect to find in here but they've also got a matching tan lotion and a, fan, a tan facial oil which sounds really good because i think anything you can put in your skincare to help you get like a natural tan saves like an extra step in your skincare so that may be one i come back and check out another time so this brand Sunkiss. they've got an express one hour tan a medium and a dark i think the express would be me because i do not have a lot of time when i'm tanning but that actually sounds really really good it's a one hour tan it's 95 percent natural formula and it's only 5.99 so i seeing as i needed one of these anyway like i needed something to tan with gonna pop that in my basket oh my gosh Whoa. i'm in face mask heaven guys look at this So they've got a whole collection from Yes2. Now I have been meaning to try their products for so, so long. So I may pick up one of those sheet masks, but they've also got things like the Sukin masks over here. You guys know I love myself a bit of Sukin. They are one of my favorite, like vegan friendly green beauty brands. I have tried this mask before guys. Oh my gosh, it is so flipping good. It's like, oh, and this one, I love this one too. Oh, absolutely fantastic if you have oily skin. This is the oil balancing mask. So if you have oily skin, blemish prone skin, you pop this on, it is very, very good at like drawing out the oil and the impurity. So I love that one too. Also got lots of the Dr. Organics range. Now I have noticed a lot of that throughout the store, actually Dr. Organics, obviously you'd expect to find a lot of that in here, but this sounds really, really nice. This is the deep pore charcoal mask and it's a five in one. So that one sounds quite good for like beating spots, but then I also look quite like the sound of this one. This is the organic coffee espresso face mask. So that one's going to like wake the skin up. That one's going to soothe it so i may may have to get both of those but i also really have just stopped spotted these rather than a sheet mask oh my gosh maybe i get one of these this is like it's got like a roller ball on it guys how cool is that and then there's also this one here which is a peel off mask oh my gosh i'm literally in face mask heaven okay now i've just stumbled upon this brand called ethique who i have never ever like found before but oh my gosh i am impressed so you basically buy like the individual products and you can also get like kits depending on like your hair and skin type and then you have like in shower like storage that you keep them in so effectively you're not getting any like plastic containers as and when you get like your top ups and stuff and you can still pick like the entire target range of like skincare body care hair care stuff and just store it in your little box and how flipping cool is that like we are trying to cut down our plastic usage as a family and this isn't something we'd naturally have thought of before but this is definitely something i would do because it will definitely help us cut down the amount of plastic we've used and then we can basically just like pick what we need as a family and we are cutting down on the waste as well as the plastic bottles I also really love this, the zero waste refill section. So this brand is Faith in Nature and all of their products come in huge bottles and you refill your bottle rather than buying new packaging every single time. So this is how it works. You bring in your empty tin, you refill it, and then you pay taking the code of what you've bought over to the till. These are the reusable bottles and then you just bring it in, top up with any of your chosen product, then you grab your ticket, and pay. Such a great way of cutting down like the amount of plastic that you use. 
because like I am feeling like motivated to like go even greener with like our like family well-being products and stuff for the shower and stuff because this just makes it so easy and it's so affordable too. Hey guys, so I am now back from the ball ring and I had such a fabulous visit to the New Holland and Barrett's like concept store. It looked amazing. Like I would never have guessed when I walked in that that was a Holland and Barrett store. Like it's completely different to all of the others I've ever been in. Like, and kudos to them for making it feel like an actual beauty shop you know like some of the other places you shop for beauty like I walked in and it just like I think traditionally we always associate Holland and Barrett with like um well-being supplements that kind of stuff but when I went in there and they were I was chatting to the guys in there they told me that there's like over 800 beauty conscious lines now and I was like wow that's crazy so it just shows how much of an offering they now have um and they had this really beautiful like section where you could like sit and have like product demonstrations and stuff like it just looked really green very very like friend earth friendly it just yeah it blew my mind I really loved the new store it looked fab so I had the best time like mooching around browsing all the new lines um I like I think you'll have seen from the vlog like I did not know that you could get brands like Ren Clean Skincare, This Works, all those kind of brands there like it's amazing that you can now get all of those big name brands and so much more when you're shopping in Holland and Barrett. It's going to make my life so much easier when I can now like get my skincare and my supplements all in one shop. So I thought I would jump on here now that I'm home and just show you the things that I did pick up because obviously I splurged a little bit um, and I know that you guys like to see what I pick up. So let me show you what I got from the new store. So this is my bag of goodies. It is full of lovely products I picked up. So I'll show you what I got across like all of the beauty bits that I looked at. The first was obviously some Ren because you guys saw how much I absolutely flipping love the fact that you can buy this there. I went for that Radiance Renewal Mask. I thought, well, that sounds perfect for winter, doesn't it? Now it's a full size 50 mil and basically you just pop this on. It works to regenerate the skin cells and hopefully leave skin with a brighter and more radiant glow, which I think we could all agree we need a little bit of in the winter, me especially. So I'm very excited to try this um, again. I can't remember if I have tried it. I've tried so much from Ren, I lose my mind when it comes to remembering what I've tried from them, but I'm very much looking forward to popping this on and hopefully looking a little bit more radiant because my skin is kind of dull right now. I also got a top up of my very, very trusty AHA lotion. It's like the, the daily tonic. It's basically a toner and an exfoliator in one. So it's one of those cult products that everybody who uses it is like, oh my gosh, it's so good because it just gives your skin an even like better and deeper clean when you're doing your nightly skincare. Now, I wouldn't recommend using it twice a day once a day for me is enough um, but it's one of those products I never let myself run out of it's just so easy you just pump onto the top with your like cotton pad or reusable cloth or something and you're good to go just sweep over the sin, sin? <laughs> skin and it's so good just an easy to use for every day so I highly recommend checking this out so I've got a nice couple of Ren bits which I'm very excited to crack out Another one of the like, product areas that you saw me guys spent a lot of time in was the This Works section because they had some really nice products and actually I was gonna go for my you know trusty sleep pillow spray, but the Stress Check Breathe-In Rollerball sounds perfect for me and it smelt divine, very aromatherapy-like, very relaxing. And I can be a little bit of a stress head sometimes. So like when I'm working and I've got loads going on, I'm gonna keep this on my desk and hopefully like roll it on my pulse points and it should help to really, really calm me down. And I would never have thought to like, see or pick this up anywhere else especially in Holland and Barrett I must admit because I didn't even know a product like this existed this works is one of those brands that I struggle to actually see in store so I have to buy their products online so sometimes when you're just buying what you need like your top up of the pillow spray that I use all the time like you then don't um 
browse the full range. So it was really nice to see some new products like this, which I didn't intend to get. So that was the really nice thing about shopping in there was seeing such a huge range of products and being able to browse and pick up some extra bits that I hadn't banked on. Okay, now I also could not leave that mask section because the face mask section was calling my name. Like I'm a big face mask lover. So I did actually go for both of the Dr. Organics ones that we looked at. And do you know what guys, these were really affordable. I was so impressed with how affordable they were. And that was quite a nice surprise because is Holland and Barrett's new beauty range. It had some really high end products. It had like all of the rare and this works and stuff, but it also had some really, really great, you know, equally as green friendly, vegan friendly products, but for a much lower price point. And Dr. Organics, I've tried their products before, so I can vouch for the fact that they work regardless of, you know, the fact that they are a budget friendly brand. So these were a no brainer for me. I'm very excited to try this one. This is the Deep Pore Charcoal Mask. It's a five in one. It literally is going to hopefully get rid of all my winter blemishes. And then obviously the coffee one because I thought that one sounds quite cool and anything with coffee in will really help to perk up the skin so good couple of face masks there and I'm very excited to try them out too. Okay so you'll have seen from the vlog that one section I was especially blown away with was the makeup section. I did not know you could get makeup in Holland and Barrett especially so many great brands. We had Inica, we had Lily Lolo, there was quite a few in there wasn't there and I must admit that this lipstick I struggled to pick one of because those swatches that I did guys all the shades were like so me. I love a good pink lipstick but I did go for Romantic Rose which I think will become a very, very good staple in my handbag and my lipstick collection. But I was very, very pleased to see such a wide variety of beauty products and makeup products like them, um, all green friendly, SLS free, like just everything that would tick all of those boxes if you are especially into green beauty. And now you can get everything, a full face of makeup, as well as your skincare and your supplements all under one roof. So I couldn't leave without a little bit of makeup. You guys know I love my makeup. Okay, a very practical brand for me, face halo. Again, I did not expect to find them in there. Now these guys are reusable makeup cloths. Now I've always been a cotton um, pad kind of girl with my skincare, but in the last couple of months, I have really tried to switch out the fact that I'm now using reusable pads um, and cloths and things because A, it's a lot better for the environment. I'm not chucking stuff away and these should last me for flipping ages. So there was a three pack here. I think it was about 18 pounds for this, but you just use them the same as you would like a cotton pad or if you were um, like using a flannel or anything like that. And the way that they are made basically means that they will help to lift out anything that is left on your skin. So I use um, one side with my micellar water to like take all my makeup off and then one side with my cleanser. Um, I've got three in there, give them a wash in my normal washing machine, guys, just with my normal washing stuff, like good to go. So that was very practical and very usable. So I was glad to see Face Halo in there. Also next to Face Halo, they had some like magnetone stuff, like blown away by the brands that they had, like if you hadn't got that already. Okay, and then last but not least were some of those eth ethic products that we saw. Now these are for my family because I really liked how many different sections there were in the store specifically designated to like reusable beauty. So this Ethique product, we also had a couple of other areas where you didn't buy like complete new product products. You could just buy a reusable container and then buy the replacement product and like refill the canister or refill the pot or something. And I just thought that, that was a really great way of cutting down on plastic usage because as a family, that is one thing we are trying to do is cut down on our plastic usage. So I picked up the Ethique OT Delicious. This is the shampoo for little one. It's a, so it's a solid bar for children to help wash their hair with. And then I also bought one of the reusable pots. Now this obviously, I guess I'm trying to see, it's a bamboo in shower container. So no plastic again. And the idea is that you literally, you keep your um, shampoo or your soap bar or whatever it is actually in there. And then you never ever need to buy a plastic bottle or packaging for your reusable sap shampoo. They had conditioner, they had like body washes, they had loads there. So I was really impressed with that. And I thought it's a great way to get my children more acquainted with less plastic products and more eco-friendly products. So very excited to try these out. And I think I could have gone mad and spent like so much money on buying all of those like reusable type things because I just love that. And I think the message that it gives um, to beauty lovers is amazing. You know, sustainable beauty doesn't have to break the bank. You can get really Really great everyday products that mean you don't have to have any plastic and then all you do is just top up as you go and I just think that that message is really really great. 
So guys, there is what I picked up with my little uh, Holland and Barrett beauty haul. I do hope that you've enjoyed seeing what I got from the new, um, the newly revamped concept side of things in the beauty area over there in the bull ring. It was such a great store. I loved being there. It was very relaxing, very calming. There was like nice plants everywhere. It was just, yeah, it was super, super fun to be there. Um, I hope you've enjoyed seeing everything that I picked up. Are there any products in there that you're like, oh, I think I'm going to need to check that out. I'd love to know if you guys already shop in Holland and Barrett, what kind of things you get in there. And if you're as surprised as I was at how many amazing brands you can like now get when you're buying your supplements and all your other well-being products as well because very clearly Holland and Barrett are now upping their beauty stakes to become a major beauty retailer and there's a lot of budget friendly as well as top end brands there like there's no reason you can't do all your beauty shopping there now so it's definitely one to consider when you are making your next skincare and beauty purchase. Guys, thank you so much for watching today's video and my little vlog shop with me. I do hope you've enjoyed it. If so, please do click that subscribe button and ring the bell so that you're alerted to when all of my future and upcoming videos come out. And also head over to my Instagram and give me a little follow because I love connecting with you guys over on the gram. Make sure that you check out the Holland and Barrett website and head over to the Birmingham Bull Ring store if you are local just to check it out. I think you're going to be as impressed as I am. Guys, as ever, thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. It's always a pleasure chatting through my buys with you. I look forward to seeing you very soon for my next video. Bye.